Hi everyone, I'm Grattles, and welcome back to Satisfactory Episode 3. So yeah, the last time we left off, we automated some iron so that we got some plates. We have concrete over there. We have copper up there that's making us some wire. And we put down these foundations and we're standing on the hub. On this episode, we're going to be working on Tier 2. So let's go ahead and check out... Oh, let's drop uh what we have to do for tier two so tier two we have five milestones and i think we're going to be working on let's take a look so in the parts assembly we get an assembler copper sheets rotor modular frames and smart plating in the obstacle clearing we have chainsaw biofuel and inventory slots here we get a jump pad not too interested here we get some resources in the sink. So we get the awesome sink, the awesome shop, color cartridges, and build a gun. And then we got logistics, which this is gonna help majorly. But I think before we do any of these things, I think we're gonna do, let's start off slow. Let's do with the obstacle clearing. I do wanna cut some trees down and we do want some biofuel. Inventory slots would be great. Uh, so we get some more inventory space. And then we'll do parts assembly, logistics, and the sink, and the jump pads last. All right, let's get started. So as you can see, we need screws, we need cable, and we need concrete. So let's get out of here. Uh, let's see, there we go. And we know we're making the concrete. It's not efficient, no. But uh, over here, we have wire. Let's come over to here. And we are making wire here. We could turn this wire into cable over at our crafting bench or we can add another constructor and turn this into cable so the wires turn into cable in another constructor let's take a look at that all right so if we click in here there we go we have the cable right here and we're going to select that and we're going to go over to here and we're actually going to press number three connect that right up and that should produce us some cable once we get it hooked up to electric but as i said before in the last episode let's get rid of that uh we were running tight so we hold on he's oh we have no fuel so i have no biofuel made so we are really um going through leaves like crazy we need to make some biofuel not only that if you look here we're running we're consuming about 17 and the capacity is 20 there's 12 it bounces around here let's take a look we're consuming eight we got 20 and it's the production you could see kind of bounces around as well we're gonna need a biofuel burner but before we do that i think our best bet is to actually make some biofuel so we can actually do that with a constructor so let's actually remove this constructor get all the parts back we'll remove this sorry buddies we'll take some of that and let's down here we'll just on the side here hook up a quick and easy biofuel maker let's go into our storage and let's sort through this and we're going to place just leaves for now and i think we have some more in our storage bin over here actually we don't we're gonna need more leaves but anyway let's go ahead we're gonna make biomass with leaves and let's go ahead and connect this to the hub now hopefully we do not lose power we'll find out in a minute let's see we need a connection all right is it on? I think it's on. Yes, it seems to be working. Perfect. Let's take a walk down here. And there we go. We're making biofuel. And we blew a fuse.
All right, so that seemed to work out quite well. We just had to reorganize some of our uh, electric, and we definitely need biomass. We're burning right now wood and leaves, which is not quite practical. But we are working on it, which is in here. And I think while that is working, I will do this off camera. So this way, you don't have to sit here and see it. I'm going to also collect more leaves and wood to make more biofuel, and then we'll get back. I'll see you in a couple of minutes. So as I was running around collecting leaves, I saw this doggo. And I had some fruit, so I decided, let's get a doggo. All right, so we're doing well with this. Uh, I let it run for quite a while. And now we're going to go ahead and set up another power source. So let's go into Q. We're going to go into power. And we're going to need a biomass burner. Um, let's go ahead and see. I think we're going to need to put this somewhere over here. But let's go get some wire because we need some wire. And I think we'll set up the biofuel back here. So let's go ahead with Q again. We're going to set up. Let's set this up on uh, right about there. There we go. And we're going to need to feed this with fuel. So let's go ahead and grab that. And let's connect it all up together. So as long as we have the power going through one, we should have it going through all. Uh, let's grab two. We'll run a power up. Oh, we're missing iron rods. Of course we're missing iron rods. Let's go get some iron. And let's go ahead and make some rods. So this episode, what we thought was going to be one thing, turned into another. If I'd continued to go ahead with tier two, this episode would be way too long. But I think this episode is good to keep in because it shows you how things can go wrong and how to fix them. So yeah, uh, it, it definitely turned into not what I thought it was going to be. And that happens. Uh, that happens quite often, actually. So let's go ahead and hit two. We're going to grab that, put it to that. And then let's go over here. We're going to hook up our iron really quickly. I don't know why I disconnected it to begin with, but it's all right. At least I have something running a little bit. And we blew a fuse there. No issues to worry about. We're just going to go ahead and hook that up to this oh that's four all right we're not gonna get there all right let's come back to here and let's grab this one um let's grab this one to here and we're going to delete this guy don't worry we're definitely going to fix this up but that's what we're gonna need i think to get it all running so let's, let's see. E, let's pull this down. Nope, we are not. Let's see what we did wrong. That is hooked up to that. That is connected to that. These two are not connected, okay. So let's connect this. Uh, connect this to that. All right. And that should connect everything together. Hopefully. There we go. That's running okay. And that's running. So everything's up and running. So I think what we'll do before we get off is let's go ahead and split this up a little bit. We're going to actually redo this area uh, because I think it's going to be more practical. 
and we have the power for it. So let's take a look at what we have to do. So I want to put in something that's going to make us um, some rods because we have screws to make. As you can see, we need that for quite a bit of things. Let's take a look in milestones, parts assembly. We're going to have to make rods again and screws. Cable is not too big of a deal. Um, rods again. So yeah, rods are going to play an important part. So let's go up here. Let's reorganize this and set this up for rods and plates. All right, so as you can see, we have some toolboxes. That is because we ran out of space in our inventory. So we're just gonna go ahead and see what we could dump off into our little storage container here. And then we'll pick up what we can. So let's get rid of the wood. If we can get rid of that, the flowers, uh, some of this ore, biomass, some more ore, and the portable. Oh, nope, we're gonna need the portable miner. All right, perfect. Let's go pick up uh, everything that's in these toolboxes. Once we do, everything will disappear. So let's go here, take all. There we go. Perfect. All right. I also want to clean up the electrical lines, but I think we might do that in the next episode. We'll see how much time we have left. So let's go ahead and jump in and we're going to see the way this is. Let's see if we could add a space there. And let's see what we have over here. We have some more space here we can actually utilize. There. And maybe even that one. All right. Let's come down. We need the miner first. So let's go into production, miner. I'm going to swing this around. And I might just angle this just a little bit. Just like that. So this is going to come out, and we're going to need a smelter. So let's see what this offers us. So we have 120 per minute. Let's go into the smelter. This, once we click that, it smelts 30 per minute. Hmm. We could probably put another smelter. As long as we can afford it. Let's try it. There we go. Then we're going to go grab two constructors. All right, there we go. Let's go ahead up here and put in another constructor. So now if you middle mouse click this, you can just copy it. So it works really nicely. Let's line that up perfectly. There we go. And the last thing we're gonna need is some organization. So let's store this in another storage container. And let's see. How far back can we push this? Right there. Creature is in the way. Because my dog won't get out of the way. Come on, dog. Move, move, move. As soon as I get it lined up perfectly, he's got to be in the way, of course. Alright, let's try this again. Move up a little. There we go. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and hook this all up. Now we're going to need a splitter. So actually I have to turn this miner just a little bit. Or it's not going to work properly to get to the splitter. So let's go ahead and put it... Uh, production miner. We'll probably do it... 
that way. Logistics, we have the splitter. So we could do this, hopefully. I don't know if we're going to have enough room. Maybe. Ah, oh, yeah, we will. We will have plenty of room. We want the end to be on this side. Perfect. There we go. Alrighty. So let's get this to the end. This out to here. This out to there. And so on. And jump over. Jump over. Alright. So that should have everything we need. Except power. So let's make rods in that one. Let's make plates in this one. Let's go back here to our smelter. We got iron. It's already set to iron. And I think we're good. So let's get out of here and hook this up to some power. Alrighty. We got six, four, five machines. Alrighty. So let's do a power right here. And a power right here. We're going to go grab the one from the back. Pull it. Come on. Come on. Oh, I'm missing cable. Of course I'm missing cable. Let's go make some cable. It's another thing we're going to automate. Alright, that should be enough to get us going. So let's go ahead and try it. I'm going to press 2. We'll hook these two to this one. We'll hook this one to this one. And this one to this one. And then we could even hook the miner to that too. And as long as we hook that there, that should go. So everything should start working. These guys say it has no power. That's only because we didn't hook this up. <laughs> So that would help. Uh, let's go from here to there. Alright, so these are just sitting idle right now because we have to get our ore. And that should get us going. So I think what we might do now is hopefully we'll have enough power to put another constructor over here. So I'm not going to worry about wire so much. We have a little bit of a backlog in here right now. So I'm just going to leave that and then I'm just going to have them making the cable and that should give us enough to enough wire that we don't have to worry about it. Let's turn this around. We want the end back there. There we go. I'm just going to hook up this to this and then we need a storage container. Does not like being there. I'm wondering if we should put it off to the side here. Um, where it's flat. Let's see. Could we fit it here? We can. Let's do that for now. Go like that and like that. Let's grab some power. Uh, where are we going to hook that to? There we go. Let's go ahead and select wires. I mean cable not wires. All right, so I think that's going to conclude today's episode. It was definitely different than I thought. We had to fix uh, some electric, do some bio burners. We also added some rods to go with our plates. We added some cable to go with our wires. And we are doing well with electric right now. We'll probably have to set up another bio burner eventually, but next episode we are going to work on tier two because now we are automating quite a bit of stuff that's going to get us further in the game so if you like what you see and you're enjoying these episodes please leave it in the comments below and like subscribe comment and share and i'll see you next time thanks also a quick note this episode i decided to do commentary instead of voiceover let me know which one you prefer do you like the commentary or do you like the voiceover do you like it sped up do you like it slower just let me know in the comments below i'll adjust uh to what you guys like thanks again Bye.